What do you know about Danny Gatling? I mean, he played a long time ago. Not a long time, but he's been in the league for a bit. He played receiver for a bit from New England. What do you, what do you think you might have there? Um, I didn't know much about him up, up until the time uh, you know I came back. Um, uh, he's been here. He is. Uh, I, I like him. I mean, he's an athletic guy. has has talent. I'm not sure why he hasn't been able to stick anywhere. But I think he's uh, um, he's intelligent. He works at it. He likes it. He's been good to work with. Tom, coming out of that rookie minicamp, how, how beneficial was it for him to get you know the amount of reps, the amount of work that he did, especially being in that that three four role, working a little bit harder during the off season program? Well, it's always beneficial. I mean, it's uh, prior to that we were just. You know, meeting. We were doing individual work on the field, and weren't I, at, at this not until next week can you, can you do any teamwork? So it was. It, uh, he liked it. He enjoyed it. Um, it. You get a different kind of look um, when you're doing it. I don't want to say live, but doing it against a, a real defense as opposed to just walking through things or talking through things or watching on film. So he enjoyed it, and it's it, uh, it's a benefit to get any rep you can get. Well, I mean, the guys who are here now, they're just trying to, I mean, this is Jordan's third year. I mean, and they're just trying to become more familiar with the offense uh, where things, you don't have to think about it as much. You just get clicks and, um, I know he got most of the reps once we start doing the team reps. He got most of them last year. He'll get most of them this year. So, like I just said, that getting reps against a defense is, is beneficial to anybody's growth. I'm not sure Aaron's plan is. You probably do. I don't suspect you're going to share it with us. But when he's here, do you give him as many reps as possible to maximize whatever time period he's going to be here for? Oh, that, that's still to be discussed. I mean, I... I um, We'll have to see what the program is like um, during the OTAs. I know it's a little bit different than it was previously when I was here. Um, so, but uh, Aaron doesn't need reps at this at this time of the year. So, I mean, it, it's obviously be nice to have him here. But he's he's seen these things a, a, a thousand times, and um, he'll he'll be ready to go when training camp starts. Sure, I guess I I know he doesn't need the reps, right. but he probably does need some rapport with all these new guys who need to throw the ball to. Him, so well, to. I mean, it, I, I think it's best for them to to um, learn what's going on, and and so they're ready to go in training camp. I mean, because at this time of the year, they're learning, making mistakes, learning from their mistakes, so that hopefully when training camp comes, they're they're ready to do their do their best. And then I think that uh, there'll be enough time at that time for Aaron to work with them. Tom, what's been your first impressions with Ben Kurt? Just kind of getting a chance to get to know him a little bit and just kind of see his his skill set. Well, he's um, you know he's been around the league for an, I don't know the number of years, but he's a, a, like like Danny. He's an intelligent guy. He uh, knows knows the system pretty well. Um, uh, I enjoyed working with uh, all these guys, uh, Jordan, Kurt, and uh, um, Danny. Um, so it's, you know, we've been working on the things that uh, we used to do a lot in, in the old quarterback school we had here in, in Green Bay. And um, I think each guy has enjoyed it. And I think each, uh, each guy has gotten better, at least at the fundamentals of the game. And hopefully, you know, when we go 11 on 11, uh, that'll be able to, they'll, they'll be able to show that. Tom, have you talked to Aaron recently in the last few months? Did you get a sense of eagerness to get back in the building and, and be back on the field? Uh, well, he was back here a while ago. I guess he was at one of the Mil one of the Bucks games, and uh, he he stopped in, and uh, uh, that was I guess I don't know what two three weeks three weeks ago or so. Um, since that time, some text back and forth, but. Uh, you know he'll he'll be ready to go. He'll be eager to go. He's just uh, you know he's at a different stage of his career now, where you know, he's taking care of himself uh, in in the uh, working on his what he thinks he needs to work on physically, and uh, he looked good when I saw him. Um, so he'll be ready to go.